All right. Uh, good morning, supervisors. I'd like uh, to speak about the um, well, as why good people turn out turn out bad. A U.S. Tri striker tank unit in Afghanistan, uh, known as the Kill Team, murdered innocent civilians and mutilated their corpses. I have some pictures uh, to show on 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 the display here. Uh, it's size a little big, but uh, it's easy to find uh, articles about this. It's all over the press. Uh, it took Germany, it took press in Germany to let that out, even though that happened over a year ago. Uh, although notified, the officers failed to stop them. Uh, the uh, Pentagon apologized twice. It's really worse than Abu Ghraib. I sincerely believe that these men were born good, raised well, and turned out to be bad by the situation, but still guilty of their crimes. Now, here's a couple of other people. Here's uh, Marty and Jesse. And everybody loves Jesse, and most people uh, love Marty, or at least a lot of people love Marty. Uh, he's got a big fan club anyway. Uh, Marty admitted on national TV that he beat people up and destroyed evidence in the murder case of Lisa McPherson. Now, Jesse uh, admitted uh, doing this at Gold Base. I went directly to my room and retrieved my Colt 45 revolver, my Mini-14 assault rifle with banana clip fully, fully loaded. I had extra clips in my pocket for the 45. I went back to Ms. Cavage's office with my guns pointed at him and the group he was standing with. With calm reserve, I told David Miscavige I would kill them all. It was like time slow to crawl, and I could see it in slow motion. There's another guy here, Mr. Rex Fowler. And he was loved by most until he shot Chancho in the head because of his uh, of. Fowler's $200,000 donations to Scientology. What made these decent Americans evil? Some say it's Scientology tech that makes them go crazy. Others say it's because of David Miscavige, the scarface of Scientology. Well, maybe. But I think there's a more obvious, well-documented reason, and it's referred to as the Lucifer effect, well-researched by Dr. Philip Zimbardo. I spoke about that a while back. And it's worthwhile to put up his slides and compare to see what applies to Gold Base. I'm just going to go through uh, quickly through the slides here and who's responsible for make, maintaining the, uh, these conditions. It's really the situation. So I'm just going to flip through uh, quickly here. And uh, here are the lessons we need to learn about that. Uh, now, the Scientology claims they have enemies, and these enemies are ex-Scientologists, critics, lawyers, journalists, and legislators. They're all at risk. These people are dangerous. People also locked up at Gold Base are at risk. I believe that this board can and must act in unison and demand that Gold Base uh, be opened up for an investigation. Here I have um, the uh, Riverside Sheriff as now assigned uh, two people uh, for uh, human trafficking, and I highly recommend you contact them and everybody else watching this video. Thank you.